Hello, I'm Kevin Wacknell. I'd like to explain how these simple mudras can get you into one of 10 possible psychological, emotional interaction states with yourself or with another person. On the first one, touching the thumbs to the pinkies, this is the ring of water. In yourself, it means calmness or you're running around, flowing like water, doing thing, things in your life. With another person, it means when someone enters your space, you leave. When they leave, you return. When you enter someone else's space, they leave. When you leave, they return. Two meanings, one with you, one with another person. Then the realm or ring of wind, thumbs touching ring fingers. Personally, it means... When you're alone, inspiration, you hear something interesting, you read something interesting, you think something interesting. With another person, it means avoidance. When another person comes, you go away. Person comes, you avoid them. Now, if you go into someone else's space, they go away. You go into someone else's territory, they go away. That's the wind ring or wind domain of experience. Then fire is you're warm, you're thinking, you're planning with yourself or with another person. It means interaction. You interact with another person. Then the realm of earth or groundedness. With yourself it is you're sitting on your butt, on your chair, and the earth doesn't let you pass through it. It supports you. Or you can have your ground in front of you so no one can go beyond your boundary. This is more like with two people. Someone comes, they can't get past your boundary. You come to them, you can't get past their boundary. The domain of ground or earth. Then there's the domain of space. It holds everything together. Every experience comes from space. Every experience goes back into space. This also has an obvious physics meaning. Then there's the domain of um, metal, which is, see the mudras like this in your lap. It's the Zen, uh, Soto Zen meditation mudra. It means I see what is really true and what is really going on. It's like I can read the writing on the wall. Um, mudra. The physical motion is pushing to the left, pushing the metal to the left, pushing the metal to the right. That's the metal domain of experience. Then the you domain of experience is basis of the thumbs touch, energy is, is focused outward. You are important to me. It's that whole thing like when you're driving, the other person is more important than you are. And when you're with another person, basically they have, they are, they can be more important than you are, but they are important to you. Then the domain of, I am important. It's like holding a cup of water or see the, um, the corners of the hands touch. I am important to me. My thoughts are important. Um, my deeds, my actions are important. That's the domain or the ring of me. Then the domain of the world is you know, the physical world, 24,000 miles around the equator. Um, you put your hands flat in your lap and you just notice everything that goes on in the world. Then the 10th domain, the domain of God is you put your arms down, you relax, you let go of your personality, you let go of your thoughts, everything. God or the universe or the world takes the next step for you. That's the domain of God. Okay, thank you for listening. Now, don't believe that these mudras work just because I said so. Try it yourself and see if it works for you. Thank you. Have a good day. Goodbye.